So welcome back, everyone. We are live on Facebook, so I want to say hi to everybody out there. You can't see me as much, uh, but except on the GoPro, we can see me the whole room in here. So I want to say hi to everybody out there. Like us and follow us. We're going to be sharing the show in just a little bit. I, my next guest has also been on with me once before. Great timing to be coming on right now. I have with me uh, Anna von Strassenberg, and she is the owner of, well, it's L. Anna, I'm sorry, L. Anna von Strassenberg, CPA. You have been doing what you do for quite some time. You said that you wanted to talk about some, you know, specific things today that are really important for people to kind of, you know, think about. Welcome to the show. Tell everybody a little bit about yourself and what you do. I actually started in the industry in 1990. Wow. Uh, day after my 30th birthday. So it was a life-changing experience. Uh, I worked at a CPA firm. Kind of just worked my way up. Uh, started off as a receptionist and decided to go back to school and get my CPA while I was working, which was a challenge, but hey, I was up for it because I saw what they were doing and I loved it. Wow. I just, I love, I love numbers and I love taxes and it works for me. And you um, loved it so much that you became the owner. Yes. When That's my, pretty neat. When my boss retired, he offered me the opportunity to buy his business and I jumped on it. So now I get the big corner office. I absolutely love that story. Now, uh, today you said you wanted to talk about some different things. What's the first thing you want to talk about? Well, most important, there's been a lot of talk about the stimulus checks, but this problem that some people didn't get them, even though they qualified. Uh, they get phased out for single between $75,000 and $87,000, and for married filing joint, $112,500 up to one hundred fifty. dollars So if you're making over $150,000, you're not going to get it. But if you did qualify um, and you didn't get the check, you can take a credit on your tax return for 2020. Well, I'll tell you, I, when you told me that, I was so excited about hearing that. I called two people. And this is what I love networking is all about. It's, to, you know, maybe someone that, you know, maybe you got your check, you're great, you're fine, no big deal. But maybe you know somebody that didn't. Tell them about this. They may not already know about it, but you know what? If they don't, you might be, one guy I called was like really excited that I called him and told him that. Because he didn't just get the second one. He didn't get the first one either. So he's really happy. Yeah, keep in mind that the IRS got really backed up with processing tax returns because they were closed down for a while, and there's some things that require hands-on by the IRS to review things. So sometimes returns didn't get processed, and so therefore the stimulus checks didn't go out. So, you know, yeah, this is the thing about life in general, especially when you're checking in with the IRS, you know, the DMV, the IRS, they're kind of the same when it comes to processing things. But ourselves, too, this, as you said, is a good time for people that can still plan for their taxes. I know I wait. I know a lot of people that do. Let's talk a bit about that, too. Well, there's some things that you can do to reduce your taxes if you have a setup have a retirement plan. Some retirement plans allow you to contribute up to the filing date of your tax return, and that includes extensions. So you could go out as far as October 15th and make that retirement contribution. So if you're self-employed, you can contribute to a SEP. You have up to $57,000 you can contribute. For a simple IRA, you, have, you can contribute $13,500 or even a traditional IRA, the traditional amount is $6,000, but you can do a catch up if you're over 50 of $1,000. You know, you have a new, brand new uh, website that we're gonna put out now. We're really excited about that. This also is a flyer. If I, I'm putting it out on Facebook right now to everybody so can see that. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about the flyer and what it's got on it and why you wanted to put, you know, have it up on Facebook? Well, we did uh, put out the flyer for um, other networking purposes, and uh, it just simplifies what we do, that we're doing tax preparation, that we have IRS representation. Um, I am certified in three different states. I'm certified in Arizona, California, and New York. And I have represented many people with the IRS. Yeah, and you know, the else that you do is QuickBooks setups. And we want to talk about that because a lot of people love that but don't really know how to do it, don't know what especially to set it up. We're going to open up the lines to the audience for everyone to get entered in to win. It's a QuickBooks setup for your business. 
right? It's awesome for people to have that, uh, especially if you've never done it, you're going to love it. Our number here is 602-277-5369. Toll free, it's 1-866-536-1100. I'm going to let everyone call to get uh, entered into win for this. It's a QuickBook setup for your business. Um, you could call her direct. You do free consultations when you work with people. How does that work when they call you? Uh, when they call, I, I invite them in, or, or we can do it over the phone. Um, I haven't done any Zoom webs yet for my office because I, I don't have a camera on my computer. Well, I'll tell you what to get. I just found <laughs> anyway, that out, too. But uh, I would be open to that. If somebody wants to do Zoom, I have my laptop that will work. Um, and I will do one hour of consultation and find out what you really need and whether I'm a good fit for you. So the number to call her direct, it's 480-964-4030, or visit her at uh, ArizonaCPAs.com. So CPAs is uh, with an S. So ArizonaCPAs.com. You can also call in here, get yourself entered into win, a QuickBooks setup for your business. How important is that for people to have? A lot of people are starting new businesses right now. It is extremely important. You don't want to keep your business receipts on a, on a spreadsheet or, or your you know, shoe box. I have had, literally had a client come in with a very big shoe box. And uh, you want to start off on the right foot. Keep track of your expenses, keep track of your income. And QuickBooks is best used when it's set up correctly. Yeah, so how does somebody know? Because a lot of people say, well, I can, I can do that. How do they know if they can't? Well, that's the problem. People don't always know. Um, it's best to con consult with a professional to find out what your business needs. There's different setups for different types of businesses, and each business needs something different. So our number here is 602-277-5369. Toll free, it's 1-866-536-1100. Get yourself set up correctly before you start doing it, even if you've already got the, the QuickBooks, make sure that you're doing it correctly. That's what she's going to do for you. She'll either set it up for you or make sure that you're doing it correctly. Our number here is 602-277-5369. Toll free, it's 1-866-536-1100. Do you work with any size business? Who's your, who's your client? Um, mostly small businesses. Um, you know, mom and pop, medium-sized businesses. Uh, we have some people who are in the real estate business. Uh, we have some manufacturing clients. There's some solopreneurs yeah. out there. You help yeah. them too. What about people that are working out of their home right now? We I have can a lot, help them as well. A lot of people so. working out of their home. A lot of people have started new businesses. Get yourself started on the right foot and get yourself QuickBook set up. Our number here is 602-277-5369. Toll free, it's 1-866-536-1100. She talks about tax preparation planning. That's something that you can do right now. She also uh, is just multi-state. You can do uh, nationwide when you work with uh, to do your tax returns, or how does that work? Um, yeah, I can work right out of my office nationwide. I've done some a lot of work remotely, so you don't even have to be here in Arizona uh, for me to do work with you. And if you're from a different state, that's my forte. And she also uh, can help you if you have any needs for IRS representation. And you know something, you might just need that. A lot of people may, may not be in trouble or anything like that, but you want to make sure certain things are being taken care of, and she can take care of that for you as well. QuickBooks setups, that's what you're going to learn from her, and she's going to make sure that you get that your business set up right from the beginning. So our number here is 602-277-5369. Toll free, it's 1-866-536-1100. We're going to go to a break. When we come back, we're going to talk further about some of the different points that you want to bring up. You've brought up a lot of them. And uh, the website to visit her on, it's a brand new website for her. It's Arizona CPAs, that's with an S, dot com. You can also call her direct. She does free consultations. She's rated with the Better Business Bureau. She can help you uh, valley -wide, not no valley -wide, uh, nationwide if you need. Her phone number direct again, 480-964-4030. Call in here, get entered into win, get your business set up right from the beginning uh, to get that QuickBook set up. Our number here is 602-277-5369. Toll free, it's 1-866-536-1100. We're going to continue to talk because we're okay. live on Facebook, okay? okay? 
So um, w when you uh, with with QuickBooks, let's just start start with that because I know that's your giveaway here. When you are giving that away for people, how when they start getting it, even if they've already had it and they've kind of used it, how surprised are they at them not doing it correctly in the first place? A lot of people are surprised. One of the big issues is how to correctly set up the uh, sales tax so that you can pull the sales tax reports for the T Arizona TPT. A lot of people don't realize that if you're selling in different parts of the county, different cities have different tax rates, and you have to get all those set up correctly or else your reports are not going to be correct. Well, we'll talk about that also yeah. online because I think Quick, that's really important. Quick, QuickBooks. It's uh, like that old adage, garbage in, garbage out. And Just like anything else, yep. right? <laughs> yep. Um, so when, when you say that your, you said that your forte is actually people who are not in state. I, I worked with, uh, I had a corporation that had uh, tax returns to be filed in about 20 different states. Uh, with states and cities combined, I had to file about 36 tax returns for them. So. I had to learn all these different state rules, and every state's different. Oh my God, that must have been yeah. a lot on you. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, it, it's good. It keeps the brain active. So where are we here on your little lineup? I want to make um, sure I get to where you need to be. Standard deductions. Minimize your deductions by group uh, charitable. Maximize. I'm sorry, maximize. maximize. Yeah. And... Uh, yeah, some people don't realize that uh, there's medical deductions. It's 10% now, so it's bigger. But some people don't realize that there's medical deductions that they don't know they can take. If you're paying for your own health insurance, okay, we'll talk about that. Oh, yeah. So. Okay, here we go. So welcome back, everyone. So a lot of people don't realize that there's some deductions that they can get on their taxes that they don't know. And uh, we have with us Anna von Strassenberg. She's the owner of L. Anna von Stra Strassenberg CPA. Uh, you work with people nationwide. You were saying that at the break that you actually uh, kind of, we've been talking about how you are your forte is for people out of state. Tell them how you got involved in that uh, because it's pretty amazing. Well, we had a corporation based out of New York that uh, had filing requirements in about 20 different states. And between states and cities and other returns to be filed, sometimes we filed up to 36 tax returns per tax season. Uh, so I learned a lot. I had to research a lot. And so people now get the benefit of all my hard work. Absolutely. So that means that she can work with you nationwide. She does free consultations with people. You could call her direct. Her phone number is 480-964-4030. Visit her website. It's Arizona CPAs with an S dot com. We have our lines open here for everyone to get a well entered into win a QuickBooks setup for your business. And we were talking at a break because I asked you how many people who already have QuickBooks that you get in and you work with them find out that they're not doing it right and what they feel about that? Well, actually almost everybody that I have helped them with their QuickBooks, they find out they're not doing it right. And a big issue is in Arizona you have a sales tax which is called TPT in Arizona which stands for Transaction Privilege Tax. And a lot of people don't realize if they're selling products in different cities, they may be subject to tax in those cities and they all have different tax rates and that can be set up in QuickBooks 
so that you can pull a really nice report to make it easy for you. And it's important to know how to use QuickBooks. It's not just one thing to have it and put putting in the numbers because we all know it's only as good as who's putting that number in there in the first place, yeah. but also to make sure that you're using it correctly for your business. And each business is different. Everybody has a different story, but that's where she comes in. She helps people with that. We've got our lines open here for everyone to get entered in to win this. Our number here is 602-277-5369. Toll free, it's 1-866-536-1100. Let's talk a little bit about some of the deductions that you wanted to talk about and some that people may not even know about. Well, I want to uh, mention that some people don't realize that even though the medical expense has gone up to 10%, some people with a low income this year can take advantage of that medical expense and they don't realize that there's some things they can do like uh, deduct their insurance premiums if they're paying for them directly. Now, if your employer pays it, you can't deduct it. But if you're paying, which is a lot of people are doing, they're paying their own premiums, it is deductible. And that can add up to a lot. A lot. I mean, premiums are pretty high right now. Um, the other thing people forget is that if you're over 60, it's a good idea to get a long-term care policy. And that is deductible up to $4,350 if you're over 60, 60 years old. Um, anyway, uh, eyeglasses, dental, those things often get forgotten. So remember to tell your CPA or come to me and I'll remind you that don't forget your eyeglasses are expensive and you can deduct that. Expense. It's amazing what some people do or do not know. And you would yeah. think that they all know these things, but they don't. Everyone's different, right? Because, right. you know, listen, it's you're as good as that too, right? Right, and you can even uh, deduct your transportation costs to and from doctor's appointments, hospital appointments, etc. If you have to stay, uh, like at a hotel because you're getting special treatment, that's deductible. Are you finding that with people that would have had to now all of a sudden change, move, working out of their home, all of a sudden, even business owners that are still having to do that too, are you finding a difference in, in this in, for the, with the pandemic? Because the pandemic started last year, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, I'm not finding big differences, but a lot of people are, are doing things more remotely. I got all, pretty much all my tax returns other than maybe two. I got them in the mail instead of in person. And it worked just fine because when I got their stuff, I'd pick up the phone and talk to them. Right, right. And so it worked just perfectly. In turn, when we work with somebody, what does it look like? How does it, you know, for a new business to, con you know, contact you? Again, we're looking at small to medium-sized businesses. You work out of solopreneurs. She works with you. If you're out of state, she happens to specialize in that as well. What does it look like when someone starts working with you? Well, one of the things I like to do is have them get set up on my secure portal, which is in my website. That way they can send their QuickBooks files to me securely, that we can send back tax returns, PDF files. Uh, just about any kind of document can go into that secure portal, which makes it effortless. You know, once it's set up, and it's pretty easy, you just put in your, your um, email address, you set up a password, and we can both access the same file in the portal. So you get, they set up that, and then what? And then I'll usually have a consultation with them. Uh, these days it's over the phone. Find out about their business. It's important to learn what their business does so that I can best serve them. And we try to do business planning three times a year. We have once in October um, before tax season, so you can do, do uh, tax planning for tax season. And of course, when you, we get your stuff in Late January, February, we'll look at your books then and give you any pointers. Uh, I usually always send recommendations when I send the tax return. And then mid-year, I like to look at the books. Hey, see how it progressed, what's it doing? You know, should we take any steps to correct it going off course? So it's really important. Then not only that, she will also help you if you have need any IRS representation. She's here for that too. Uh, she, we talked a little bit about the uh, business and tax and accounting obviously you do that tax preparation and planning and now is a really big time for that everybody should be getting ready we all are getting ready for that right now oh, yeah. but a lot of people do get extensions but even so 
that's okay. It doesn't really matter. You can even uh, deduct certain things up until the, your, 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 the date of your extension. Yeah, you can uh, definitely for re retirement planning. And I'll tell you, I can't say it enough. People my age have not saved enough for retirement, so make use of that. If you have a 401k at your work, make use of it. If you're self-employed or own your own business, there's uh, SEP, there's SIMPLE. You, you have those opportunities to take those deductions. And if you have an IRA and you're having a low tax year, you may want to consider converting it to a Roth. But that's something you should discuss with a financial planner or a CPA like myself. That phone number to call or direct, it's 480-964-4030. Her website is Arizona CPAs with an S dot com. Uh, she works nationwide. She's been doing this since 1990 what? 1990. 1990. She started at the way bottom, just as yeah. a receptionist. Worked herself up to be now the owner of that company, which is such a neat thing. Uh, loves what she does. Love numbers, but also loves helping helping other people l learn their numbers. And you know, it's one thing to own a business, but most of us are good at one thing, and that's our business. But we don't want to deal with the you know the the number side of things. But it's also ha wonderful to have somebody that comes in that helps you from the beginning by setting up QuickBooks is what you do as well, but also getting you through to learning how are you doing, right? How many people, some people, especially um, solopreneurs that don't really even know how they're doing. So in the mid midway through, you do it again and you kind of look and see how they're doing and again at the end of the year as well. Yeah, I, I encourage my clients to look at their books and actually look at their profit and loss and see where they're doing and so when I get them in once a year, or I mean, <laughs> three times a year, um, when I do get them in there, I say, hey, this is how your business is doing, and I want you to understand what it's doing financially so that you can do what you need to do to improve the picture. Right, or be excited because it's bringing in yeah, a lot of money, yeah. and which I, is really I, neat. I've had a client that started at zero, losing money for, I think he lost money for five years building his business. And now he's making over $400,000 a year, and he's happy as a clam. And I tell you, I bet you he is. Yeah. Now, we've got our lines open for everyone to get entered into win. This is a QuickBooks setup, and believe me, you're going to want, even if you already have it, you think you're doing it right, you may not be, and that's what she's an expert in. So we've got our lines open here, and I'll let everyone keep on calling to get entered into win this. Our number here? It's 602-277-5369, and toll-free, it's 1-866-536-1100. For everyone that's listening now, what's your final words? Uh, get to a CPA. You can save money. Uh, I had a friend who did his own tax return and had a, uh, oh, and then he went to a CPA and got a substantial refund. And it was because of? The CPA. And the CPA was? L. Anna von Strassenberg, CPA. That's who she is, and she's helped a lot of people out there. She specializes in working with people who are even out of state, um, and, and you might even have one or two or more businesses. She can help you with that. Please, everybody, this is a great time to be working on our books and to be starting this. If you started a new business, a lot of people have. Maybe you've even been in business for a while. You've never used QuickBooks. It's a great thing to use. And if, if you don't know how to use it, which a lot of people don't, even though you think you might, she can help you set it up and make sure that your numbers are correct and that you're doing everything else correct as well. Call or direct. Her phone number is 480-964-4030. You can visit her on her website. It's brand new. It's Arizona CPAs. It's with an S dot com. Call in here. Keep on calling. Get entered into win this QuickBooks setup. Our number here, 602-277-5369. Toll free, it's 1-866-536-1100. She does free consultations. She works nationwide. She is rated with the Better Business Bureau. Again, give her a call and tell her that you heard it on the, on the air right here at Networking Arizona, 480-964-4030. Or call in here. Get entered into win. Start your business off right, or even if you've already started, make sure it's going correctly. 602-277-5369. Thank you very much.